So you can kind of see that, you know, we're starting to kind of create job descriptions, you know, things that we can start to implement into a robot, right? So if, if this is something that's based on transportation, we can say, well, this thing can carry um, objects, it can, it can, you know, drag or tow whatever huge boxes and whatnot. Well, I, I want to design a mech that has, you know, four legs. Um, but I, I really don't like the, these proportions. I, I, you know, if you notice, there's certain repetition that I'm, I'm creating for myself. It's very top heavy. It's very elongated. There's like kind of spindly legs. And, you know, I feel like I'm not getting as much variety. But when you look at it, you're like, man, this thing's really cool. It, it feels like it's all consistent because they use the same family of shapes. And that's design consistency. So when we have our when we have our idea, you know, and, and we're ready to kind of start stylizing, you can start thinking about, you know, what is the shape language of our design. And again, this doesn't ha this is this isn't only applicable to Mac design, but anything that you really design, characters, whatever it may be. So it has the locomotion of a pivot hinge, but also rotates. This is the beginning of understanding mechanics. Okay, you have to simplify your information. So I, I think, you know, if we look at just, I'm gonna choose these three right here. And what I wanna do is I wanna start consolidating my ideas. Um, I think what we gravitate towards is just kind of the, 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 the attitude that's being presented here. You know, everything's kind of leaning, slightly leaning forward. So it tells us that's a little bit more aggressive, that this mech isn't used for passive, um, anything passive mission. You know, it's, it's more of an active based uh, mechanism. Um, whether it's bipedal or quadruped, I think it's, it's kind of up to us. To make this process a little bit more simpler, um, I'm gonna just draw with a pen. I'm gonna do a really, really rough squiggly drawing. Um, this is an industry, we call this chicken scratching. And I just wanna kind of get my base idea out. You know, I don't wanna to commit to anything, any details yet. I just wanna think about, you know, how is this thing gonna look in a three quarter fashion? Um, just where the legs might stem out. You know, I, you can block everything out just in a very, very basic manner like this. This kind of looks like a little bit like a, a cricket or some kind of insect. Arms and some kind of mechanical device out here. 